All right, folks, still got to stain the, uh, the two barn doors and got to paint the front and the back door and then touch up the paint inside of here. But uh, everything is getting pretty close right now. This may be the last video I do on this little house. I may do it after they get all the furniture moved in and get it uh, get it looking good. Uh, I'm gonna put a little kitchen table under that thing right there, under that little old chandelier. I had an old refrigerator used and I just donated it to the cause right there. Oh, everything, all the other appliances are new, but right now it's just really hard to get, you know, to get, uh, to get a hold of any kind of appliances for some reason. I don't know what the deal is, but, and everything is just high, super high. Well, matter of fact, that fan right there, I think oh, it was around $700. I think now it's close to $1,400. I mean, it's, everything's just gone out of sight. But front and back door, get it painted, get the paint touched up. Got to put a little over, uh, cover over that switch there and uh, paint or stain and then put the clear coat on the barn doors and we should be, we should be kicking pretty high. Uh, blinds should come in uh, within the next week or so. So they'll be putting the blinds, you know, the blinds will be put in, uh, got a, a do the septic in the back back here, still waiting on it. Oh, old boy's covered up so bad. <clears throat> Excuse me. Old boy's covered up so bad he can't uh, can't get over here to do it. So I've been waiting on him for a little bit, but maybe he'll get in here pretty quick. Oh, didn't have any cell phone service in the house at all. I mean, zero. So what we did is we put a little uh, booster outside on an antenna and while we were doing it, just went ahead and put an antenna for the television up there to get local channels. Oh, we got 33 local channels, which is awesome for where we're at out here. And oh, we got plenty of uh, cell phone service in here with that booster that's outside. Those things are really, really nice. But she's coming on pretty good. Still got uh, toilet paper holders and towel holders and stuff like that to do. But, uh, you know, check this out. This turned out, this turned out pretty good, too. Like I said, she's still a mess right now, but... Got plenty of hanging space. Not too bad for a walk-in closet right there. That's my stomach growling. I'm about to cave in. But that right there is going to be sweet. That's sweet. Looking really good. Everybody's asking about that fan, though. Let me tell you, that fan is something else. It is beautiful. But when you do get one, just get ready to spend about probably a good hour, a good solid hour putting that thing together. When I got that fan and took it out of the box, I covered that entire bar with parts and then put it together. It, it is, it's a pain. It's a pain, but it's worth it. Looks good. Oh, I had some problems with the cracks and the beams up there. They, you know, that sawmill lumber, once I got it in this, in this uh, air conditioner, they dried out a little bit. So I had to get up there and caulk and putty and stuff like that to cover some of the cracks. And I was, I was disappointed in that. I knew it was gonna happen when it hit this air conditioner, especially with the humidity like it is outside. But uh, they turned out good anyway. Hope y'all enjoyed the video. Hey, y'all have a good one. Appreciate y'all.